Hey, 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 that has been quite some time since I last made a video. <laughs> so this time I have, I have been uh, doing something like a turtle, turtle bot, I call it the Tupperware bot. So yeah, here we have the RP LiDAR, we have a Raspberry Pi 4, see the motors here, there is an Arduino and some electronics to control the motors, there is an a PID to control the velocity of the wheels. And right now I'm going to demonstrate navigation and slam on this robot. I'm quite excited. So I am using VOS2. Here I am starting the slam, the navigation, and you know, the robot uh, state publishers. Let me start our viz in here. So I'm going to start our viz. Where is the map? Show me the map. Yeah, here is the map. You can see here is our robot. Let me just rotate the view a little bit. Exactly. So here is the laser scan on the front. The wheels and there is the Tupperware. Yeah, you see the same view both from Arviz and from the real robot. Let's try navigation right now. I'm so excited. Will it work? Ooh, nice. So I just gave a gold pose in here. I told it to go straight front. Yeah, if it is moving. Hmm, nice. Nice. Let us, let us go here. See what's gonna happen. It's rotating, moving around, and will it come here? Oh, nice, this is cool. The right to the place. I don't know why sometimes I have issues with the orientation of the laser scans. Hmm. Check the package. What's going on? But anyhow, yeah, the slam is compensating. Yeah, it avoided the camera actually. Here it's moving back behind the camera. Here is the camera, and actually it, it avoided the camera and it didn't hit it. Hmm, this is nice. Let us go back to the front. Ooh. Yeah, it shall go from back to the front. Here, from back to the front. See? We play a little bit here with the camera. Portrait. It didn't blur oh, us, blurring the background a little bit. No. Light vision. Can I have the filter? Okay. I don't know. Oh, look, I can also enable the flash. So that's it. I think right now we're moving to mobile robotics. It was quite exciting, this project. It was nice and fun. Probably later I'm going to explain more about this project. You can see here, this is the Raspberry Pi 4 that I'm using. Ah, see you later guys, bye bye.